She has done a great job representing Walter Parker Primary School. Watching her achieve great success this year has definitely been a pleasure of mine. Please welcome the valedictorian of the class of 2013, Ms. Abigail Victor. Deuteronomy 28 says, The Lord will make you the head and not the tail. You will always be at the top and never at the bottom if you pay attention to the commands of the Lord. Turn to the person next to you and say these words, The more I believe, the more I achieve. To the Ministry of Education officials, other government ministries, special guests, principal, administration, staff, and teachers, family, friends, and the class of 2013, a pleasant good morning. Vision is something like a blueprint. It comes before believing, and it comes before achieving. We, the class of 2013, have successfully achieved the requirements for graduation because parents, teachers, and other loved ones had a vision. Let us reflect on how much we have achieved. We can still remember when we did not know how to do fractions or what were prepositions. There was a time when we did not know how to speak properly. Now, we can speak much better and even a little in a second language. Hola, mi alegro del verte hoy. Hello, I am glad to see you today. I remember when we did not understand the importance of conservation, but in science and social studies, we learned that we must protect our natural resources. And in religion, we learn that we must be good stewards over this beautiful country that God has blessed us with. You who are athletes, your parents remember when you could not walk. Now you are some of the fastest runners and highest jumpers. You who are singers and musicians, your parents no doubt remember when you only made noises. Now you are making music. Over the past six years, it was at this great institution that we believe and we achieved all that and more. Who are we? The Class of 2013, I am sure you will agree with me. We have come a long way. I encourage you to celebrate it, but don't stop here. There is so much more to achieve and so, there is so much more to believe and so much more to achieve. To the students we leave behind, you are our little brothers and little sisters. Don't limit yourself. You can go as far as your mind allows you to go. Remember, if you believe it, you too can achieve it. To my teachers, Miss Daisy Biddock and Miss Cassandra Williams, you laid down a good foundation. Miss Violet Major, your teacher made me top achiever in the grade 3 GLAD results. Mrs. Anastasia Clark, you taught me well. Your classroom became my home away from home. Miss Ruth Nell Deems, you encouraged excellence. And grade 6, Miss Cynthia Smith, you made me mature quickly because focusing for an excellent finish was important to you. mention of special teachers like Mistress Marsha McCarthy, a key person in helping me to place in the top 12 finalists in the Student of the Year Foundation and winner of a $1,500 scholarship. <laughs> Thanks also to Miss Erica Will, Senora Ray, Mistress Mufra, Mr. Ferguson, 
Ms. Russell, and Mrs. Salon. You all played a significant role in the development of our lives. We also have a great leadership team at Walter Parker Primary School. To Mr. Bethel and Mrs. Parker, Senior Master and Senior Mistress, you are the pillars of strength. To Mrs. Angela Burroughs, Principal, thank you for encouraging me in so many ways to achieve and to not give up. And to Mrs. Monica Smith, the Vice Principal, you are the wind beneath my wing. You made me truly understand that nothing is impossible. I thank God for all of my accomplishments. For my parents, Pastors Eddie and Margot Victor. For my grandparents, Alva Stone and Rachel Edwards. For my Aunt Jerita Edwards Alton, who is no stranger to Walter Parker. For all of my aunts and uncles, and many of them are here today. Thanks so much to my God, parents, and youth leaders at Liver Waters Assembly of God. Ladies and gentlemen, and to my fellow graduates, I leave you with these last words spoken by Dr. Miles Monroe. Hard work and diligence are essential to success, but they require an internal motivation. That internal motivation is vision. Thank you and God bless.